means of communication. In today's fast-paced world, we don't have time to visit our friends and relatives. It is because most of the time we are busy in our professional life. In some situations, various means of communication help us send and receive our messages. Sending or receiving a message is called communication. We speak, write and use signs to share ideas and information with each other. These are the ways through which we can communicate. Telephone, mobile phone, television, email, newspaper and letter are some of the important means of communication. Telephone. The most common and the fastest way of communication is the use of telephone. Through telephone, we can talk to people who are thousands of kilometers away. Through fax machines attached to telephone lines, we can send messages very fast. Nowadays, mobile phones have made it possible to talk to other people even if they are in remote areas. Amazing fact! The first mobile phone was invented by Motorola on April 3, 1973. Email Electronic mail Email is the latest technology in the field of communication. In this system, a person can type a message and send it to the email address of his or her friend with the help of a computer or a mobile phone. Extra Byte To send a message through email, both the sender and the receiver should have a computer device and internet connection. Letter A letter is a written message from one person to another. We write our message and send it to someone through post. It is an old method of communication but still in use for sending written or printed letters, applications or documents. Newspaper Newspaper is also one of the very important means of mass communication. It gives us information about the daily events. Reading a newspaper every day is a very good habit. Do you know around 2400 crore newspapers are published around the world every year. These means of communication have brought all parts of the world closer to each other. Television. Television is another popular means of communication. It is used for conveying public policies, notices, advertisements and news. We can also watch films, plays, cartoons, sports programs and live events on television. It is harmful to watch television for a long time continuously. Besides these means of communication, there are other means of communication such as radio, fax, Facebook, Twitter, blog, SMS, WhatsApp, etc.